little foot, is that you? Yes, Grandpa. Your grandmother was beginning to worry. I'm sorry. Are you mad at me, Grandpa? Why would I be mad at you, little foot? Hey, dear, watch. I saw you talking. Who? Big nose. Oh, little foot, I know you're not disrespectful, but for some reason you've gotten off on the wrong foot with Mr. Thicknose. I don't know why. I try to listen and ask good questions. Sometimes I think he just doesn't like kids. Yet Mr. Thicknose volunteered to share his wisdom with you young ones to give you the benefit of all the knowledge that he's gained through the years. I know. <laughs> you know, Littlefoot, Grandma and I have you, but Mr. Thicknose has nobody. Really, he has nothing but his dignity. Dignity? What's that? It's the feeling that you're appreciated, that you have something to offer and others know it. It's a very important feeling, Littlefoot. You should never do anything to rob someone of it. I won't, Grandpa. <sighs> and I won't say anything to Grandma about this. It'll be our little secret. Thanks, Grandpa. But there are only a limited number left! Limited number of what? Why, you don't know about Holly the Half Warmer? <gasps> you seem like some pony looking for a gift for a very special friend. I am. A friend who wouldn't want to miss out on the must have gift every pony is talking about? She certainly wouldn't want to miss out on that. A truly awesome friend who deserves something 20% cooler than any other gift out there? That sounds just like her. Well, look no further. This is it! Ooh, ooh, how much does it cost? How much do you have? Sure look tired. Up all night watching the big flying rock storm, eh? Uh-huh. Yes. Well, I expect there will be more flying rocks tonight. Oh, yeah. More flying rocks? That's right. It's all part of the flying rocks of many nights. Flying rocks of many nights? Huh? That's what they call it. And for good reason, too. of several nights then the flying rocks will pass so while they're here you'll see them light up the darkest night but flying rocks up in the sky are no reason for fright in the sky the flying rocks streak by in the sky you will see them way up high in the sky somehow the rocks can fly today and I was wondering where that might be. Oh, okay. Uh, let's check. Name? Uh, Rarity? <clears throat> oh, here we go. Your package was
was delivered to Sweet Apple Acres. It is at Sweet Apple Acres. Yes, it's for Applejack, but I will be delivering it. That's my job. It's a gift for Applejack from me. <gasps> what if she opens? It went to Sweet Acorn Orchard instead. <laughs> oh, well, that's a relief. Why? Is that a relief? Because Applejack's not in Sweet Acorn Orchard. Do you want me to get the package and deliver it to her? No! <clears throat> May I have the address for Sweet Acorn Orchard? I think I'll just collect the package myself. Are you sure? Because I will be happy to... You have helped so much already. 